I'm going to show you how to make the Jenny Gammy Dolphin. This was one of the first designs I ever created, so it's one that's quite special to me. On the CD you get three options as always. You get the plain black and white or you get two coloured alternatives. For this one I've chose one of the coloured ones and I've cut it out twice and stuck the back and the front together so that you get double sided coloured card. Now for this you don't have to cut things like the word friends out if you don't wish to. If that's too intricate just cut a straight line and don't worry about it at all or Cut a square and add some words using some sticky letters. You get two C sections in this. You get a section with a mummy and a baby dolphin that you can cut the extra bits out if you wish or you could just leave them like this. You get the word friends. You get a hoop for the dolphin to swim through and you get the main dolphin. This one's really simple to put together. We take the main hoop section and the dolphin section and the hoop section from the centre slot and the dolphin section for the centre slot are just going to slot together like that so that the dolphin is swimming through the hoop. We're then going to take the water sections that have a slot at the middle at the top and these are going to slot under the section with the dolphin at the slots at the bottom. And we do exactly the same on the other side. So you then have the two water sections in the hoop going one direction and the dolphin going in the opposite direction. We then take any one of the other parts, it doesn't matter which one, and these have a single hole at the bottom and two slots going upwards either side. This is going to slot over the bottom section here of the hoop and then slot underneath the two water sections at either side. So if we slot this over the hoop and then the water sections have a slot at the bottom that we're just going to lift up and slot over either side. Oops. We're then going to do exactly the same at the other side with the remaining part. It's going to slot over the hoop section in the middle and we're then just going to take the water sections and slot them over on either side. You then have your completed dolphin design which folds perfectly flat for putting inside a card or a scrapbook page and just by standing it up it goes back to its 3D shape. If, like me, you're not very neat at cutting some of these things out, what I plan to do is then just take a nice blue ink pad and go around the edges of the design to finish it off. I hope you like my dolphin as much as I do.